uh, we'll go ahead and get started. Uh, first of all, let me uh, welcome everybody. Uh, good afternoon, and uh, welcome to the second webinar in the Creative Stage Lighting Educational Series. Uh, before we begin, uh, just let me touch base on a couple of housekeeping issues. Uh, you do have the capability during the course of this webinar to submit questions uh, about the presentation in the, uh, the chat box. Um, what we'll try to do in the interest of time will be to hold most of the questions until the end of the session and then try to answer them at that point. Uh, if we aren't able to get to all your questions during the live event, we will respond to you via email after the session concludes. OK, um, on to the webinar. Today's event will take a look at the converging technologies of the entertainment lighting market. Uh, the rapidly changing lighting world brings us a wide variety of lighting and effect options that can be blended together uh, to create a vision, uh, either by the pr production designer or the lighting designer, uh, anyone involved in um, any kind of live event marketing. Uh, all of us saw what can be achieved through the blending of diverse technologies to create the ultimate show while viewing the recent Olympics in Beijing. Uh, the opening ceremonies gave the world a hint of what is possible when art and technology come together. Uh, the intent of today's session is to provide the lighting professional with information regarding the tools available to achieve that kind of vision, some of the ways to apply those tools, and examples of some of the application possibilities. Uh, this webinar will give us a perspective on the technologies that are driving our industry today, as well as an overview of where it will be going in the future. Uh, during today's webinar, we'll be looking to get feedback from you by asking you some polling questions. Uh, to show you what I mean by this, and to get a brighter idea of the makeup of the audience, I have a couple of quick questions for you right now. If you are a, a lighting reseller or um, professional, uh, what markets are you focused on? Uh, so if you could take a look at the poll, uh, cast your vote, and uh, that will give us a better idea of uh, who we're, who we're going to be, be speaking to. get about 90% of the votes in. If anybody else has a desire to cast their vote, uh, please do so. And then we'll close the poll and give you our results. OK, so based on, um, on that information, 68% uh, of you are focused on live events and, and touring events, 57% uh, on the corporate event market, 64% on permanent installations, and 18% in the other category. OK. So what I'd like to do at this point is uh, introduce our presenters, uh, give you a little bit of background, and then, uh, then turn it over. Uh, today's presenters are both industry veterans with an extensive knowledge in the area of converged technologies. Uh, they've both been intimately involved in the development and introduction of advanced technologies that are helping to, uh, to drive the converged marketplace and provide lighting professionals with the tools to achieve truly outstanding results. Craig Burroughs has been the Northeast Regional Manager for High-End Systems since 1991. He's worked extensively as a key consulting contact with NBC, CBS, ABC, and Fox Networks, as well as many Broadway productions. He's been at the forefront of introducing new high-end products for the past 17 years. John Calcagno has been with Barco since 1990, beginning as a customer service engineer, and moving on to head up Barco's customer service and quality control departments. In 2000, John joined the newly formed rental and staging division, where he works with touring groups and corporate staging events. John's primary focus is in the area of um, LED, projection, and switching needs. Um, I'm Kevin Loretto. I'm the director of dealer sales for Creative Space Lighting, and I'll be your moderator during today's session. And what I'd like to do at this point is uh, turn over the controls uh, to Craig and let him drive the rest of this presentation. And as I said, please feel free to, uh, to sh ask any questions as we're going along. OK? Go ahead, Craig. I think you've got control now, so take it away. Let me see if I do have control. First of all, I'd like to thank everyone for participating in this uh, Creative Stage Lighting webinar. Um, we believe that it's a bidirectional um, productive event and not only for our company to convey our message to you and 
get you involved in what we're trying to do and accomplish here, but also uh, get feedback from you that's very useful for us uh, moving forward uh, to help us determine uh, training seminars, uh, product development, uh, things of this nature. So thank you all for participating. Uh, for the sake of this presentation, we will be showing uh, Barco-related product, both for the Barco Lighting Systems product uh, and also for the Barco and Media, Media and Entertainment uh, division. So, uh, of course, any other product could be used in these applications. Uh, we just wanted to use our product because uh, we're involved. And, and you will not see them, but we'll be displaying subliminal messages with product spec sheets, pricing specials, and stuff. So hopefully we'll hear back from you. <laughs> John, you want to say hi to him? Hey, everybody. Just uh, appreciate you guys uh, logging on, and uh, I'm just sitting here in my Halloween costume right now, uh, listening to Craig uh, give his presentation. So, uh, <laughs> Thanks, John. I'll jump in in a bit. Thank you very much. Let's see if I have a control of the system here. All right. Kevin, I actually do not have control. Okay. So feel Try free to keep it. Okay, I'll keep it. You just tell me when to uh, when yep. to switch. Slide, please. Yep. So this is a good example of a uh, converged event. We have uh, screen LED screen panels, front surface panels. Uh, we have projection systems involved. We have Mitrix creative LED products involved, image control and processing involved, uh, digital lighting involved, uh, as well as uh, conventional analog lighting involved. Slide, please. Uh, one of the reasons, uh, just to talk about the convergence and the recent acquisition of high-end systems by Barco. Uh, Barco traditionally was a video, uh, video manufacturing company, video products, projection products. They got into creative LED several years ago. High-end was a traditional automated lighting product manufacturer. Uh, we did as well produce and manufacture uh, special effect equipment at one point in time. But uh, a few years ago, we decided to focus our resources on developing digital lighting and the tools to um, provide that experience to the end user. So uh, we have about 37 or 38 uh, existing digital lighting patents, which was very uh, interesting for Barco. Uh, they started looking at us uh, a couple years ago and recently acquired us. And the reason is because the digital can canvas, uh, which is represented here in this slide, is a good place for growth for both companies. Us being there and one uh, a little bit ahead of Barco, they acquired us, so we feel like that's a really good a good fit for both companies. Yes. So the convergence of video and lighting markets, it is the convergence of product level and also the convergence on the customer level. Uh, that's you, that's the end user as well, people that are becoming more familiar uh, with the tools involved, uh, seeing them at trade shows, getting some hands-on training, uh, and as well, analog and digital lighting transition within lighting is the digital lights, the media servers, the LED, the tools themselves. And the lighting. part I love about this is that whole digital canvas, you know, the merging of that to create that, that effect that the, uh, the, the person with the vision is actually looking for. Exactly. Slide, please. Great. So um, we'll talk about the Barco Media and Entertainment Division, uh, which John and I both fall within. Uh, this particular division of the company focuses on advertising and branding, uh, the tools to do that, the tools to convey uh, sports advertising, scoreboards, large video displays, uh, also events division, and the digital cinema division. Slide. Um, obviously, the exterior LED uh, display uh, market is huge and growing every day. Uh, of course, if anyone's traveled to any of the major cities, they see a lot of the signage out this, at this point in time. A lot of media, a lot of advertising. It's just so easy to upload custom content and for the owner of the sign uh, location uh, to see huge revenue returns.